Hi! In this video, I will walk you through setting up your undated digital planner. Undated digital planners are great because you can use them over again and don't have to buy a new planner each year. They take some time to set up initially, but this great hack that I am about to show you will save your time and let you set up your undated planner quickly. Go to the monthly page of your planner. If you are using GoodNotes app, make sure to click this pencil icon in the top right corner to be able to use the links. You can fill in your page by writing down the numbers, or if you want it to look more neat, you can use number stickers, type the numbers, or use the numbers that you already have here on this page. With Lasso Tool, screenshot and copy the numbers. Copy and crop the numbers one by one and arrange accordingly. You need to do this only once, and for the next month, just copy the numbers, paste to the next month, and just rearrange like so. To fill in your weekly pages, just copy the dates of the current week from the monthly page and paste onto weekly page. As for the page dates, they are already dated and accessible from every monthly and weekly page. You just have to mark the day of the week. Now let's go to the index page, where you can see an overview of all the sections and templates included in the planner. Since this is an undated planner, this yearly calendar page is blank, but you will insert a calendar there. Your purchase comes with calendars for the next five years. Just use Image Tool, find the calendar image, and insert. Then you will have access from the Year tab. For each month, you have a monthly planner with linked corresponding monthly overview and finance. From the monthly planner, you can access weekly planners that are linked to the corresponding weekly pages like schedule and weekly notes. When you are on a weekly page, I suggest that you mark the current week like so. You can access daily planner pages from any weekly page. Notice this quick menu at the top. It includes sections that are available to you from any page in the planner, like quick notes, to-do lists, project folders, meal planner, yearly finance, and one custom page that you can use for any other template that you want to have available at all times. For example, let's use this routine planner template. Select and screenshot it with Lasso Tool.
Paste at the center of the page and resize. Note, when you use stickers on this page, if you want to move them around, you can't use Lasso Tool anymore. Because it will select the template too but use the Image tool to move the sticker, resize it, etc. This digital planner includes many additional templates to help you organize your life and work. Let's flip through them. As for these numbers in the quick menu, they will lead you to project covers that you can use to organize any content. Just insert some of the template pages from index after those covers and duplicate as needed. Your planner comes with many additional covers that you can easily replace. Pick Image Tool and find the folder with the covers. Center and resize and fit your new cover. Thank you for your time. Visit our channel for more demonstration and how-to videos. If you have any questions or requests, write me in the comments below. Cheers!